Changes could be coming for fishers who frequent the uh, Skyway Fishing Pier. Yeah, a very popular spot. And today in Jacksonville, conservation groups are pushing for a change at an FWC meeting. This is all in an effort to save pelicans and other birds. Now, Aaron Parsegian is live at the Skyway Fishing Pier this morning with a look at some of those proposed changes, Aaron. Yeah, this is a popular spot to cast a line or two. Even this morning around 5 o'clock, there's several anglers here trying to catch a fish. But, of course, casting those lines is inherently dangerous for the pelicans and other birds in this area. Many of them often get tangled up in the lines and get injured from that or being caught on the hooks itself. But there's an estimated 2,000 birds killed each year. And for years, groups like Friends of the Pelicans have been pushing for changes. At their meeting today, the FWC is expected to propose changes for the South Fishing Pier, including a seasonal ban on multi-hook sabiki rigs, which often are used to catch bait fish, and treble or three-pronged hooks, which are popular among local anglers. FWC will also likely propose reducing the number of rods allowed on each pier per person from currently three down to two. They can't lose sight of the fact that they are required by law to protect the birds under the Federal Migratory Bird Treaty Act. All the compromising is great, but the bottom line is it is their responsibility and they need to keep sight of that. Now, coming out of today would just be proposed changes. A final vote would likely happen in a few months, and any rule change wouldn't go into effect until October, but just something people should be thinking about. We're live on the Skyway Fishing Pier North this morning. Aaron Parsegian, 10 Tampa Bay.